شي بلادي عشت حد واماراتنا عشتي لشعب دينه الاسلام هديه القران حصنتك بسم الله يا وطن بلادي بلادي مشاهدين اهلا وسهلا بكم في حلقه جديده من برنامجكم برنامج اماراتي كما عودناكم ان نستضيف لكم نخبه من رجال الاعمال وسيدات الاعمال داخل دوله الامارات العربيه المتحده يسعدنا اليوم ان نقدم لكم قصه نجاح جديده مع الاستاذه ديانا جود افتنون ديانا جود افتنون هاو ار يو توداي ام فيري فاين ثانك يو ذاتس جريت سو وود لايك تو نو اباوت يور سيلف هوز ديانا فروم ايرلي ايرلي Born in the Republic of Moldova, it's a very small country, but grew up in Italy. Oh, that's great! So Diana today is a CEO and the founder of Q1 Realty. Mm -hmm. mm, but long time ago, as a young girl, it was a girl that was really fascinated by architecture, by interior design. As you know, Italy is famous for that. So I think that. was the spark for my passion to start in this kind of industry, mm -hmm. real estate industry. So after my studies, I have traveled and I have discovered many countries. So in 2000, I landed in Dubai and I uh, really discovered a beautiful country. I fell in love with the, with the people, with the amazing culture, with tradition. And, uh, I saw also that at that time the real estate was really developing and taking shape. So I saw immediately an opportunity for me. So I decided to move to Dubai and uh, maybe start my own business. the market very well before uh, you establish your own company so let us talk about the Emirates what did you see in this country different than the other countries as a business at that time uh, I was really like just in love with the place I saw this place like my place where I can grow further where I can develop where I can build something on my own And of course, you know, Dubai is full of opportunities and uh, everyone who wants to start uh, their own business is really welcomed and uh, it's really easy uh, to make your dreams come true. Let us talk about uh, when you just start your own company and step by step, of course, uh, you were small and you grow up year by year till we reach here. So let us talk more about the company and which kind of services today you have. So Q1 Realty was established in 2006. Um, I started with a small group of brokers that shared the same 
passion as me for the real estate. At that time, it was uh, really, Dubai was real estate market was just the perfect place to invest and uh, it has attracted a lot of investors from different uh, countries and uh, you know the real estate law also was uh, adopted and the foreigners uh, were welcome to buy and have possibility to buy and to invest in the real estate market. So at that time I took the decision to establish this company and I had a vision and a mission to, make, to provide to those people who are coming to Dubai uh, a platform to find their second home for investors to have uh, good advice and support. This is how it happened. <laughs> okay. That's it. Yes. So, after that. So, so after that, well, of course, many years passed. Now the market have developed. So did our company as well develop? Today yes. we have uh, four active divisions. We have uh, property management, holiday home, interior design, and of course the brokerage, real estate brokerage. Division. There is a big challenge between this kind of companies, how you know inside United Arab Emirates. So how you prove yourself in the market? Let us say, what is the specialist in your company? Mm -hmm. What is special about our company? As, I, uh, as you know, the competition is very hard here. And especially in the real estate, it's a real estate industry is a major industry for, for Dubai, we know then I think uh, people make the difference. People that work in the company, uh, we make difference, yeah. So we're not only selling you the property, but selling you an experience and peace of mind, I would say. Of course. So uh, let us talk about the best project you was working on. I believe the best project is my company. Of course. <laughs> in my life, mm -hmm. this is my project. So this is my baby and uh, I believe that when we started, we started small with mm -hmm. only three people. Today we arrived at 40 mm -hmm. and uh, of course it's not only a brokerage as it was before, but another three division came out of it. I mean, we have the holiday home, we have mm -hmm. interior design and we have the property management. Mm -hmm. So. We started from a brokerage because that time uh, everything was still in a, in, a, in a shape of development, you know, mm -hmm. so we didn't have possibility to have ready properties to manage. Today we have thousands and thousands of properties ready, delivered, people living in them. So people are in need of managing properties, mm -hmm. on uh, making their properties better, improving the quality of their uh, living, uh, doing their properties like a second home where you can do uh, some interior uh, design improvements, you know. So this is how we have developed from a brokerage to, to interior design. And today we are really started to be quite uh, aggressive. Uh, we got uh, also a very important uh, luxury residential projects uh, in uh, Dubai Hills to develop. So I'm really proud about this. <laughs> Let us talk about your team behind. They are your second family and they are your right hand, of course. So how you are selecting uh, your team behind to give the best quality service since we have uh, more than 200 different nationalities, mm. the different cultures as well? Yeah. As you said, I also believe in one thing, that uh, my team is my family. So here we are at our home, this is our home and this is my family. <laughs> and uh, many of our employees are here with us since long time and uh, we really like feel uh, we, are, we are a family together. So when we select the people, of course we select the experienced people with the expertise in the real estate, but we also give possibility to young people to join our company. Because I really believe the young people, they have a strong drive for innovation and uh, you know, fresh ideas. So this is also very important for the company to develop further. Of course. How many nationalities you have? Maybe more than 10, but I cannot tell you. Of course. 
Of course. So it's easier, of course, uh, for the client to contact with your uh, team behind in any other language. Of course, so it's of make it easier. Anyhow, so um, since we are here in Dubai, so we will inspire from His Highness Sheikh Mohammed bin Rashid. He's saying to reach number one, it's easy, but to continue on the same level, it's a little bit tough or difficult. So what's your comment on that? Yes, I completely agree. It's not easy to arrive number one but is easier and to maintain number one is very difficult <laughs> it always uh, requires more and more challenge more let's say efforts more improvement into your services that you deliver so you always have to be on the top it's really difficult to maintain this position yes but i think when you believe in your ideas and you have a vision you can do it Yes. And Emirates and United Arab Emirates, they are moving by uh, the vision and the future plans always. And we can see by the years the changes what's happened in this country. So um, let us talk about your vision, your future plan, where we can see you on the short term and the long term as well. I think that many people say, oh, I will move, I will expand, I will be here and there. But I really like this country so much. I don't want to expand anywhere. <laughs> I want to stay in this country to continue to develop here. Maybe opening some branches. Mm -hmm. And uh, I believe this is the best place to live, really. After this all years from experience till you reach in the success, who support you? Who was your backbone? Who deserve thanks today from Ms. Diana? Mm. <laughs> I think a big thank I have to say to my father. They, he was really supporting me mm -hmm. at the very beginning. He was uh, encouraging me to start my own business and he also gave me uh, a big support in terms of uh, advices of how to manage the company. Uh, how to develop uh, certain uh, services, mm -hmm. you know. I really uh, grateful. I'm grateful to my father. Yes, yes please, of course. Uh, so, in Emirates, let us talk about the Emirates. There is high safety, high security, and they are supporting everyone to reach his target, show his, uh, of course, uh, goals, let us say, and reach it. So, let's make it easier for the investor to invest and prove himself. So, today, a last message it will be from your side will start it from His Highness Sheikh Mohammed bin Zayed, and of course, His Highness Sheikh Mohammed bin Rashid and all the leadership of the Emirates. From my side, uh, Diana, and uh, our company to One Realty, and also from all of my team, we would like to thank you, uh, His Highness Sheikh Mohammed bin Zayed, and uh, also the leaders of this country, because we believe that Dubai is a really great place to live and to work. And I think thanks to their love and vision for their country, Dubai is becoming the best place to live not only for Emiratis but also for the expats. And in fact, after many years, I don't feel to be expat. I feel to be Emirati. <laughs> of course. <laughs> and uh, really, thank you from the uh, bottom of my heart and all of our team to making this place so special. Uh, for making, thank you for uh, making Dubai our second home. This is a really great, great nation and a great, great place to, to live in. Thank you so much, Ms. Diana. You was with us in Emirati TV program. Thank you so much for your time. Thank you very much to you. <laughs>